buy a unicycle. There is a unicycle hanging in my garage. I know that because I bump my head on it twice a year. And it's never been ridden. I have five kids. I bought it for Randy, who's now 27 now. I bought it for his ninth birthday. And he gave it, you know, a good try. Maybe, uh, you know, half hour here, 20 minutes there, an hour there, that, that summer of his, of his birthday. He never got it. Any of my kids, relatively athletic, could have had the, the ability, the balance, the, the mental gyroscope to ride that unicycle. But none of them did. And that was a choice they made, and that's okay. Because it reflects our job as a dad is to open doors for our kids, is to give them new opportunities, to open doors for them. And they will choose to walk through some of them, and they will choose not to. Um, and the fact that we open these doors for our kids is going to lead to careers, hobbies, fun things in life. And again, they're not going to do all of them. Um, <clears throat> We can buy our kids a grand piano and put it in our house and open that door, but they may not choose to. You can, you can even get them lessons, years of lessons, but that doesn't mean they're going to be the next Billy Joel or Franz Liszt or whatever. Um, we can buy them an art easel and all, this, all the, the, uh, the paints and supplies for that. That doesn't mean they're going to be the next... Uh, um, uh, Master painter. We can buy it. We can put a wrestling mat in our basement, which I did. But that doesn't mean they're going to be state champions. Okay? Actually, I did, I did all these things. Now, at the same time, you never know what's going to happen. Maybe the kid down the street is a great piano player, comes down, uses your piano, and your daughter turns out to be a jazz vocalist. So the act of opening the door might open other doors that you don't even know about, you can't even anticipate. You have that art easel in your basement, and no one ever puts an oil painting on there and starts painting it, but they use it for party games, for Pictionary. And suddenly your son starts enjoying this and starts to maybe, you know, turns into some kind of a, a game show host or a motivational speaker because that really, he uses the art easel for something different than you anticipated. The wrestling mat, maybe your daughter, maybe your son doesn't become a, a world-class wrestler, but your daughter becomes a world-class gymnast because she starts tumbling on the mat. You never know. Open the doors. Gentlemen, buy a unicycle. <laughs>